Good morning. <clears throat> my name is Sheila, and this is my Foxy Fix size 8 wide. It's a Wonderlust um, Espresso, and um, I got it around Christmas time. This is my latest setup for February. I changed out. Um, I changed out my uh, dashboards. I had. I made some new ones, and I sort of changed out. Um, instead of this being just a planner and a journal, I actually using it as a, um, I have a calendar in here and then I have some um, books in here to keep track of my uh, YouTube videos and my other craft projects. Alright, so on the front here I have a lot of bling and stuff. Um, I have these charms up here. I have a coffee cup, Starbucks. I love Starbucks. Um, a little kitty cat with a crown. I have a lock, a hot lock, and a key. And then on the side here, I have this little angel, and it says, "Never give up." This was a, a gift I had um, in a swap. On the the spine, I have this little charm. It's a bird and some little pearl beads um this i found a way to attach it because i was just leaving it in here and then when i took the elastic off it would fall and i don't want to break it um it it is handmade i didn't make it so i can't take the credit but i found this when I had bought a whole box of artist things at a yard sale and this was in the box um, this is wood I believe and they used some clay on the top and they added this emerald bead and then a little rock that's really smooth and I added this um, string here I glued it around I tr there was a metal ring around here and I tried to add a clasp to it and it broke so I just used some of this glued it and attached it to the side so now it doesn't fall when I open the book okay take this elastic off on my elastic I have this little camera I think that's really cute. Alright. On the front here I have. This little. Calendar. I um. Used. I made this grid. In a program on my computer. And I printed out. A whole bunch of them. And for each month I made a little calendar. To attach to the front. And this is. Um, the February one and I just leave it here for a quick reference oh, things getting so tangled here all right so now open up and on the front here I have a couple pictures me and my fiance and my two boys this is just some of that um, like vellum paper just folded it and put it in there here's one of my newest um, dashboards this paper pack um, I got at Michael's okay I paused the camera for a moment so that I could um, find the paper pack that I used to make my dashboards and I got this at um, Michael's and it's from Craftsmiths and it's Love You a Latte paper pad and it's very very pretty paper All right. okay so I used a uh, the um, craft paper cardstock and then I glued the paper 
on here and this is one of the labels that's also in that pad all right so on the inside cover I um I have pockets and I just got a few label things this is a um, coffee cup that I made I'm gonna have these available on my website if you're interested in finding my website just ask and I'll, I'll let you know um, here is um, like the acetate and I have a pocket filled with things and I think someone gave me this in a swap and on the back I got this also in a swap someone made me a little shaker with my name in it I just added that and then this is the beginning of my monthly calendar and this I also got in a swap this little tag here I just put it in here because it being Valentine's month and I have a little hot paper clip at the top. So this is my monthly. It's not too, too detailed, I guess. But um, I have it decorated for Valentine's Day. This tag here, um, I laminated it. Someone gave me this in a, um, an ATC swap. And I added it here. I thought it would look really nice. Um, and then I just decorated with stickers. This paper I made myself. And I printed it out with the um, gorgeous girls on it. I love those. But I made this in a program I have on my computer. And I have some clips that I use for my pen holders. And this is the back of that first dashboard and I have another one of these pockets and these pockets I got at um, Hobby Lobby in the artist section where you can find the um, books and things that you display your artwork in and I just have some sticky notes and flags in there here's another dashboard this is a spring and I'm in a rush for spring already and I created this myself. I drew it. <clears throat> this is just a paper clip that I got from a swap. But I drew this and also put it, glued it on the um, craft paper cardstock. And I just added these little sticky dots. And there's pockets on this side too. This little heart I got from somebody on a card and I cut it off and I put it there because I really think it's pretty and it goes with the color scheme these are a couple of um, Tim Holtz clips I didn't buy these I got these I have no clue where I got them <laughs> actually this one I found in the um, parking lot getting out of the car <laughs> okay this is my list book and I just got a couple little stickers here and keep track this is my index and I just got some web page information and other things in here F important phone numbers to remember addresses that's what I'm going to use this for um, this paper clip I have a few of these in here they're like rubber and I got these when I ordered things from China I believe so some of these are a few years old and I had them put away in a drawer. I never really used them before. But now I have this. I use them in here. This is another Fox paper clip that I d designed. Well, I didn't design the shape. I actually printed out this and used it in my uh, Cricut design space and cut it out. I also have some of those on my um, website. And then this pocket, I just got a couple of planner things, and I have some index cards that have lines, just in case I need to write some information or give someone some information. I have a red pen here, and then another one of those pockets which I cut down some, 
and I just have some planner stuff in there. And this is the other side of that vellum paper. I have three of these in here. Okay, this is my next one. But first coffee, I always have to have my coffee. And all this was actually in that book. And I love this coffee stained paper. I want to get a uh, uh, clear stamp for that. I haven't gotten one yet. But it has all these um, coffee cup things. And I just cut these out with a round punch. Okay, here's another one of my coffee cups. This one's black. And a couple of donuts. And I have a couple of stickies in there. And a little ruler. And this book is for my YouTube videos, my tutorials. And I just want to keep track of what I've uploaded. So I don't upload it again. But these are all my um, books mini albums and things that I've created and they've got tutorials on YouTube and some I also do some craft tutorials and <clears throat> so that's that so far and another pocket with some more there's washi tape here's another one of those rubber paper clips this one's a butterfly obviously and then this is the back, and I have another little pocket with some flags. These flag things, page flags here, I got these at the dollar store, believe it or not. <laughs> it's amazing what you can find at your local dollar store these days. And then some more vellum. Now this is another book that this page and this tag came from that same paper pad. It's so pretty. And this one's little roses. And then the inside I cut out some donuts. I don't have anything in there at the moment. This is um, another section where I'm going to put my art work or um, things that I've made. And just making it like a, a catalog for all the things I made. This is my Zentangle art. I don't know if you're familiar about Zentangle, but this is, I made a little catalog of some of the things. It's not finished, but I printed out these sheets and I'm going to go back and fill in the information about the things that I made. But this is just a few. I have sold s some of my pieces, but not too many at the moment that's what that book's gonna be yes. and then this is the back cover with another one of those rubber paper clips and this is just a huge paper clip and I have a mechanical pencil which I use for certain things like if I want to sketch something before I actually use a permanent marker and there's just a couple of stickers in there and then this is my get creative I don't have this actually attached to the book I just have it sitting back there at the moment but I just use some really nice uh, pen and ink paper that you can get at the um, Hobby Lobby or at Michaels and it takes marker magic markers really well and I just got a couple of little, I think this is just a little doodle. Yeah, just a little doodle I was <clears throat> playing around with. But that's about it. Yeah, so, and that's it. I hope you enjoyed my little flip through. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to ask. And I'll try to answer them as soon as I can. And you have a wonderful day.